Welcome back, everyone, to CrossCode, and we need to go explore around the ship, uh, although we're not going to do it to its fullest potential because I've kind of already done that. I had a problem recording. It was really strange. It's not worth mentioning. Ooh, can I climb that? I didn't try that. Anyways, point being, I have gone and talked to everyone that there is to talk to. It's nothing too terribly interesting, so I'd rather get on with it. Oh, Miss Avatar is back. Hi. Woot, she talked to me. Anyang. Gee, calm down there, fellow. Anyway, Carla just passed by us again. She told us that you could take care of all these boxes here. I mean, really? Can you believe that woman? Now she's loading off her work on our guests. Well, she has a point. It's easy to destroy these boxes with your avatar weapons, right? Mm-hmm. Anyang. Awesome. Please, I want to see that. Well, no pressure, you know. You are our guest, after all. But you'd help us out a lot. So, will you destroy the boxes for us? Mm-hmm. Yes! Show us the balls! <laughs> uh, just to spite him, I'm going to use melee. Woo, this is amazing! All right, so this introduces a new thing here. Because look at these boxes. Notice how they're kind of different on one side? You can only destroy them on one side. Which is kind of interesting. Uh, got a ricochet here, ricochet there. Whoops. All right, that'll do that. All clear. Truly amazing. I'm really surprised how quickly those balls were flying. What are you even talking about? I didn't see any balls. Only those boxes disappearing for whatever reason. Yeah, you need to wear these AR goggles to see them. That's kind of an interesting twist. Because uh, they're like virtual, but they can affect physical things, which is kind of strange to me. The balls and their impact are like virtual and stuff. I see. So that's why you've been wearing those goofy glasses all day. Goofy? You know nothing about style, lady. Yeah, whatever. Anyway, thanks for all. Uh, thanks a lot for the help. Yes, thank you so much, Miss Avatar. You know, I like that phrase. I, li I like being known as Miss Avatar. Um, so let's go up to second floor cabins. Uh, here we can see Captain and Carla. Anyang! Whoa, you spoke! Is your voice finally back? Uh, Anyang? Wait, that ain't right. Her speech synchronization is still malfunctioning. I just hard-coded the word hi into her speech module. Anyang, that is all she can say for now. I am currently working on adding more words. I see... It's a start, I suppose. Anyway, the Cap and I are here. Uh, the Cap and I here have been planning out your combat training. We're almost set and good to go, right? Aye, this is going to be interesting. Well, I'm off to my cabin for some final preparations. I'll be done in no time, so just stick with me, Captain. Okay? Or stick with the Captain. Okay? See you later. Cool. Captain, what are you doing? Aye, I'll be back on the bridge. You can talk to me when you're ready for the lesson. Make sure you're prepared. I'll be expecting your full attention. You two over there. Make sure you clean up the galley after you're done cooking. Understood? Aye, aye, Captain. It's not like we forgot since the last time he told us. Yeah, wasn't that yesterday? All right, so we're going to head up to the third floor cabins. Just one quick thing to show you up there. It's not worth doing the dialogue. No, notice Carla's room is really messy and everyone else's is really clean. It bothers uh, everyone how she gets away with it. Like, they don't know how how she gets away with captain's inspections, like, not catching her. All right, let's head up to the bridge and talk to ye captain. There you are. It's about darn time for your combat lesson. Ready? Yes, please. Good. Let's go to the balcony. Good. Here we are. Carla, are you ready up there? Yes, Cap. Don't forget the goggles. Aye. Haven't worn these in some for some time. All right, then. Time to start. I was told you learned the basics down in the cargo hold. Mm -hmm. Still, first, I want you to show me your grip on aiming and throwing. Carla, prepare the target bot. Time to say hello to an old friend. <clears throat> hello, old friend. Listen carefully. I want you to hit that robot from this distance ten times. And do it quickly. Got that? Oh, is that not 10? There we go. I thought I counted 10. I see you understand the basics well enough. That will make things easier. 
Carla, we need that turret now. Time to turn on old Betty. Next, we'll be practicing the dash. The first, uh, the turret will now start shooting at you. I want you to do two things. First, keep your aim on the turret, but don't throw anything. Second, dodge the turret bullets without losing your aim. All right, then let's start. So I gotta, I gotta aim but not shoot. Wait for the fire and then dodge. <clears throat> Got it. Nice work. That took me about 10 times before. <laughs> Enough with dodging. Now try to handle this attack, lass. <laughs> what the heck was that? Don't you know how to do a darn guard? No, I don't. Actually, Jet, as a matter of fact, she does not. I forgot to activate her guard module. Sergey, are you serious? You can't stand, or you can't send that lass into battle without a proper shield? Yes, I will fix that right now. So I get a shield, guys. How cool is that? Good. So now you have your shield. Need an introduction on how it works? No, because I already know. All right, then let's have another go. Isn't that cool? Kind of absorbs pretty much everything. Very good. That's all the basics I can teach you for now. Now, to round everything up, let's have a proper battle against the turret where you can uh, use everything you've learned. Though... There were a little. Uh, there will be a little surprise waiting for you. I'll let you take a short breather. Talk to me when you're ready. So, you ready for the battle? Yes. That's what I like to hear. Let the battle begin. Oh, whoops! Oh, -hoo -hoo -hoo. I almost dodged right into those. Uh, and he's got a shield that I haven't quite figured out if I'm supposed to like. Oh. I haven't quite figured out if I have to use, like, charged hits for the shield or what. Yeah, I don't like the shield and the dodge being on the same buttons, to be honest. I'd rather have a different button so I could be moving and press the shield button. And then just have it pull out the shield and stop my movement. Captain, I'm sorry to interrupt, but we need you on the bridge right now. What's the matter? Something is approaching us quickly. Bloody darn timing. Sorry, lass. We have to stop here. Duty calls. Carla, you clean up the balcony first and come to the bridge afterwards. Understood. Girl, I have no idea what's going on here, but I'd be, it'd be better for you to go inside, too. Oh, Captain, my Captain. What's wrong? It's still on the radar, approaching us at high velocity. No transmission, no darn ship to see. What's going on here? Captain, I think I caught it on satellite. You gotta see this. Prepare for the anime. <laughs> what a peculiar location we have here. It's a darn car cargo ship, ya dauber. You look like someone who jumped right out of the Crossworlds. Or sorry, right out of Crossworlds. This ship is not part of the bloody playground. So don't be a nuisance and get lost. We are aware of the nature of this place. Yet we perceive the presence of another misplaced individual. That's none of your bloody business. Get off this ship and back to the game you came from. Foolish mortal. Do you truly believe we will abide by your command? Did you just call me a mortal, you nutcase? You better leave right now or I'll be glad to tighten your grip on reality. You bore us. We choose to no longer converse with the likes of you. Besides, our search has already been concluded. Anyang? <laughs> you. You do not belong here. You need to be removed. Wait. You seem all too familiar. Anyang? Why, it can't be. Help! <laughs> Indeed, it might be a mere coincidence. Oh, but we must mo or, but we most definitely have a way to be certain. What a convenient stage we have here. Now, it is time to face your trial. 
Let us see if you are the genuine article. A display of your talents shall suffice as proof. Lee, do you hear me? I am just as confused about this whole situation as you are. It is certainly a mess, but we will get you out of this. For now, take on this challenge and keep him busy. I know this enemy looks intimidating, but you do not but do not lose hope. I am confident you will be able to handle this. Because I can see its battle stats, they match your level. <laughs> on young. Alright, so we can try and attack it, but it doesn't do any damage. So the trick is we got a shield from those and dodge these. Oh, I can actually just run far away from that, can't I? Oh, 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 this way, this way. Oh, here we go. So then he eventually falls and we can attack his little crystal brain thingy. Get some few extra hits in there. Good, good, good. Keep jumping, keep jumping. Oh! Let's not take those extra hits this time. There we go. There's a cool little introductory boss fight. I like how it teaches, you know, you can't always just attack everything. Like there's a there's there's patterns, puzzles to be solved in boss fights. Oh, jeez. Shadows to watch for. <laughs> and here we should be able to finish them off. Beautiful. And we level up. Cool. Uh, level plus one. CP plus one. I'm not sure what CP is. Uh, max HP plus two. Attack plus one. Defense plus one. I'm really excited to get into the leveling up because apparently the skill tree in this game is insane. This spinning motion. One cannot find it twice in this world. Truly, there is no doubt about it. When was the last time we, laid, we have laid eyes upon you? You within your incomplete vessel. Yes, you have our utmost interest. You will come with us. Oh! Captain got that rocket launcher. Greetings from the solar fist, ye pile of instant matter. What's this? Your divine powers can't handle a proper explosion? Why, you... This is preposterous. <coughs> Thank you, Captain. Okay, lass. You need to get off this ship right now. Carla, get her back to the teleporter as fast as possible, and tell me once she's got off the ship. I'll make sure no trace of Crossworlds is left on my ship. Got it, Cap. Follow me, girl. Alright, so let's get out of here. I just noticed we can talk to those people. And this is the last thing I've already done, so we're almost caught up to where I was. Well, well, our endeavor has not been concluded. <laughs> you will not escape our will. He already caught up? Lee, those are high-level opponents. Do not fight them. Run to the teleporter. <clears throat> Got it. We can sense your fear. Your escape is fear. So we gotta get through here. We got these guys chasing us, firing at us! Oh, snap! I didn't get hit last time. <laughs> I don't think dodging is really going to help. I got this. Jump over the container. Got it. We're good. Uh, how are we going to pass this one? Wait, I got an idea. <clears throat> this is pretty neat. She programs in some extra steps for us to climb up. Oh, whoa, whoa. Oh, I fell there. Yeah, can I make it? Can I make it? Yes, okay, good. All right, we're there. Here we are again. Time for you to leave this party. Come on, sweetie. This isn't the time for tearful goodbyes. Besides, there are those guys. Goodbye, Lee. Enjoy Crossworlds. Anyang, Carla. Anyang. Chapter 1, Awakening Unlocked. 
You darn pile of instant matter. Stop putting your trash all over the ship. This ain't gonna go nowhere. Jet, we did it. And by the way, notice his little graphic on his little graphic on the chat bubbles and his character on the screen all have like a damaged part of him from the rocket launcher. It's such a neat detail. Jet, we did it. But he almost got us. There are probably some enemies left down in the cargo hold. So yeah, see, look at like the blue that's like melting almost. <clears throat> Putting even more trash in my cargo hold. Okay, that's it. Playtime is over. Crew, activate the neutralizer. You're meddling with matters that are not of your concern. This is my ship. Dobbers like you messing with my ship are on the bloody top of my list of concerns. I said it before, I'll say it again. This cargo ship is not part of the bloody playground. And he turns into ice. What was that all about? So we get teleported to the playground. And the, the, the game within the game begins. And it's like so nice and peaceful here. Like the music just sounds like a like a little Pokemon town game uh, soundtrack. We did it, Lee. <sighs> I still cannot believe what just happened on the MS Solar. Anyway, we are now in the official playground. This area is packed with all kinds of security measures. More interference from the bl that blue individual is highly unlikely here. For now, let's just proceed. This is Rhombus Square, or more precisely, Newcomer's Bridge. This is the official introduction to Crossworlds. Uh, I placed you right in front of the last part. It is important that we do this part the official way to avoid suspicion. This is so neat. There's a little spawn area for all the new players. Ah, yes. Speaking of suspicion. Listen, Lee. It is absolutely essential that you pass as a regular player. We must avoid being reported at, all co at any cost. Uh, hi? <laughs> ah, Yes. Do not worry too much about your speech synchronization issues. Now, here's what I find funny about that. Is she only learned one word, but she can still add inflection to it? I find that kind of interesting. Uh, you are, in fact, not the first player with these problems. So that's good. Anyway, just be careful, okay? All right. So that's where we're going to end it. We will continue on next time. Oh. Most of these players here should be newcomers just like you. This is a really neat setup. Uh, veterans usually skip this part, obviously. <laughs> uh, it's a really neat setup. I did confirm, uh, by the way, last episode I, I asked if this actually was like sort of online. It's not. This is totally single player. The game within the game is online, which I find really interesting. It's a neat little setup. I'm excited about it. Uh, I'm still loving it. Can't wait to dig into it more. We will see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. As always, adios. Goodbye.